COVID-19 pandemic has uh, impacted our organization in, in several ways. We quickly responded by having our folks and our staff uh, wind down in-person operations to work remotely. I say we gotta heal the healers, right? We gotta make sure the folks doing the work with us are safe and sound. You don't have to be in the office on a day-to-day -day basis to continue to help people. And we've been able to do that fairly efficiently. Uh, we have taken our whole uh, platform online, our whole education platform online. The most difficult impact that OIC has had was to close the doors to the public because so many of our clients live in the neighborhood and they walk over for any type of services because we're kind of like, you know, family there. We can be there to help people no matter what the problems are. We then took to surveying our who really wanted to know how has uh, COVID impacted their lives. Um, this wasn't just to get intel, this was to really make sure that whatever response that we were going to make as a result of COVID, we wanted to make sure that we were doing it in the right way. Our organization has really stepped up and really is doing the work that other people are talking about doing. The organizations, we continue to feed people um, in food banks and a number of places around the country. We also had affiliates that weren't doing food or delivering food uh, to people within the community. And because there was such an outpouring of support, a number of our organizations stepped up, opened up their doors, or at least in front of their doors, where they could provide food services to people within the community because they saw the OIC, the local affiliate OIC, as a place that they trusted and that they valued what services they provide. And one thing is always for sure with our organization is that other people will come and go in these communities, but our organizations will remain and we will continue to do the work that's required to support our citizens um, and, with, and within our community.